All right, well, all the excitement of the holidays is over, but kids are still out of school, so yeah. what do you do with them? We've got Casey Queen here from Northern Nevada Moms with some tips. One that I love is kind of a throwback to when I was a little kid. Yeah. Roller skating, yeah. so much fun. Yeah, roller skating. So um, I grew up doing that too, like every Friday night, that's what you would do. Um, so yeah, the Roller Kingdom, they've extended their hours just during like winter break. So actually this week and next week as well, they are open daily um, during the day from one to four and it's only $5 a person and it includes skates. And really, I mean, how fun for everybody and they have like skates for toddlers and just all sizes and you know this time of year it's kind of hard to get them they're cooped up inside yeah. they got all that energy yes. they need to burn get it out on the skate track we yeah. like that also ice skating yes. is an option as well yeah ice skating is perfect and you know um the weather is really nice it's not snowy or rainy it's just cold so you can bundle up and we're lucky we have two skating rinks here locally in yeah, Reno, yeah, and then also if you want to head up to the mountains, the there's other skating, but if you want to stay local, you can go to the one at the Grand Sierra or also the rink at the Row, and they're open daily and have different hours that's, you know, family friendly for everybody. Uh, and speaking of uh, longer hours, like yes. the Roller Kingdom trampoline parks have also extended yes. their hours Really yeah, so out. they've recognized that kids are out and they're getting stir crazy and so it's just kind of nice to get out for a couple of hours. So all of the local trampoline parks have also stayed open and extended their hours to open earlier so you can get out for a couple hours, let the kids burn off energy <laughs> and then, you know, head home. And you know what a great time to also maybe explore some museums in our oh, area. Absolutely. Um, the Discovery Museum is wonderful. They were actually open yesterday because of the winter break and we were there yesterday and it's just fun. You know, the museums, there's the automobile museum and then also oh, the yeah. museum down in Carson City, which is also great for all ages. I just remember growing up at Carson City, going to that museum and you can spend yes. hours Absolutely. there. Absolutely, so there's much so cool. many different rooms and activities and mm -hmm. like I said, you can just get out for a few hours. Now, so. of course, we got one last holiday to celebrate while they're yes. on break. New Year's Eve is yeah. tonight. Some kid-friendly options for us. Yeah, so locally there's the Coconut Bowl. Every year they have their big Halloween, or sorry, <laughs> New Year's Eve party, and they are open all day today until 1 a.m. You can go there, and they have specials mm -hmm. um, for family for your entire family. Um, you can also go to the skating rink, yeah. and or you can host your own party. It's never too late to do something like that. Yeah, and do what you're doing. Celebrate yes. at 9 o'clock. Yes. So go and celebrate with the New York on uh, the East Coast. Uh, Casey, always some great options. If you need some more ideas, head to uh, Northern Nevada Moms Blog and just search yeah. for New Year's Eve and yes. the post pops up. It's a lot of great tips for yes, parents. Yes, fireworks, there's so much, so much on there. All right, Casey, thank you so much and Happy New Year. Thank you, Happy New Year. All right, stay with us, we'll be right back.